Hi there, my name is Giovanna Bernal. I'm a Panama attorney with more than 15 years of experience. Today, I will share with you what are the requirements to apply to the Panama Digital Nomad Visa or the Remote Worker Visa, which is a short state visa that allows you to live and work in Panama. This type of visa allows you to live and work in Panama for nine months and you can request an extension for another nine months. This application is submitted by a Panama attorney and you have to be in Panama in order to submit the documents for the application. And in order to be eligible, you have to be hired by a foreign company or be a freelancer with your own foreign company. Besides that, your income cannot be less than $36,000 in a year, which means $3,000 monthly. And if you are not an employee on a foreign company but a freelancer or you have your own company, you have to um, go to a public notary and um, submit an affidavit that shows that um, what are the company's duties and what are the activities, who are your clients and where your, con your money is going to come from. And what are the requirements to apply? First, you need to bring your criminal background check. Remember that all documents that come from a foreign com country have to be legalized with a postal or by your nearest Panama consulate. So you bring your ba criminal background check first. Second, you have to bring your job letter. Letter that letter will show your duties, what are, uh, what is your salary, and what are your main functions and on that company position and basic information. Third, you have to bring a certificate of existence of your foreign employer. Fourth, you need to bring the certificate of health insurance that needs to have coverage in Panama and has to be valid for more than nine months. Number five, you have to bring a, your bank statement or a certificate from your bank that shows that the money is coming from foreign income. And if you provide your bank statement, basically what we want, we want to check um, your deposits from your payments, monthly payments. And while in Panama, we're going to need uh, a health certificate. We're going to make copy, full copy of your passport. We're going to need three passport pictures and fill up power of attorney and some other form. And this will be, this will be it. This process will take around at least one month, but it can take more than that, perhaps 45 days. And once done, you get an ID for nine months. You can stay in Panama, you can work in Panama, and you will not need a work permit to work and live in Panama. And if you like Panama, and if you wish to stay longer, you might want to consider applying to a temporary permit or to a type of permanent residence. I have another video that shows what are the requirements for some of those. And also, if you wanna know more on what are gonna be your tax implications if you work in Panama or if, depending on what type of service you offer and what is the activity on your online business and what type of activity and if your that activity that you're doing is subject to tax, I recommend you to watch, to watch this video. And finally, I would like you to like and share this video, follow us on social media, subscribe to this channel and contact us for more information in the link below.